Hey everyone, TFD back here. And part two of this 1982 restoration on this 305 V8. We have here this 19, this uh, 82 Firebird. Uh, on this restoration video, I'm gonna be re um, replacing the alternator uh, for uh, an exchange for a 78 uh, no, I'll take that back. A 70 amp alternator. So, I'll be back in a second to let you guys know what sizes you're going to need to take the bolt off here. And there's going to be a bolt at the top here. And then there's, it looks like there's going to be a bolt here that I'm going to need to take off. And then in the back here, there's going to be a little clip right here that I'm going to need to take off. So I'll be back in a second to let you know what size you'll need. Okay, it's a... Now I know it's not a perfect fit. It does move a little bit, but it I'm using a 15 millimeter. And also to disconnect the battery, it's 11 millimeter. So you need to go in there. And it's a pr now I'll, I'll I'll give it to you that uh, if you, if you get ever get the chance to change these side terminals uh, side terminals out for like a top one, do it because honestly it gets kind of annoying having to keep. There we go. It doesn't take that long. At least I got that part. Then go up here. This this one's a little bit tougher. There we go. Oh, no, there we go. Okay, now it seems like it's starting to loosen up. Look at that. I bet the bottom one's going to be a lot longer though. And since it looks like, oh wait, it probably isn't. I take that back. Ooh. I'll tell you, it's pretty warm here. Out here today. Boy, I can't wait to get this thing running again. It's a good 305, I tell you. I love my V8s. Especially being this a Firebird and everything. Me, I cleaned down in there. Boy, you should uh, I should have recorded that when I cleaned out this motor. It had a lot. I mean, it had a wasp nest down there. It had leaves from sitting out. This car's been sitting out basically its whole life, so. I'm gonna make when I get when I get this thing going. I want to keep it in the garage. Come on. Sorry to keep this going so long. Oh, come on. Okay, getting there. Get. Oh my God. Jesus. Okay, it is a long bolt. Oh my. Move the shroud a little bit if it gets in the way. Alright. Okay. It came loose. And now, to disconnect this. Come on, come on, honey. Come on. Oh. And if this thing gets in the way, it's gonna, it's not gonna lie. It's e this car's gonna either be nice to you, or it's gonna be total butt. There you go. Take that. And get 
Okay, I'm gonna have to put you down for a second. Okay, there is a bolt behind, right here. Don't look like it's gonna be nice to me, is it? Okay, I'll just be back with you when I, um, when I get that disconnected. Alright, after looking, after taking the boot off, it's a 10 millimeter, and I didn't take the time and loosen it for you guys, so it wouldn't take as long. Pretty stupid of me, yeah. <clears throat> there, okay. So when you want uh, from the whoa, I got I'm steady hand. When you're looking from the direction it's facing, you want to turn it. Well, you want to. Okay, there we go. Okay, yeah, you can't see. Okay. Okay. I don't want to lose this bolt. There we go. There she goes. If you want to know how big it is, there, there you go. Hmm. Tempting to clean. All right. Well, it, do it in back reverse order. When you get put the alternator on, put this up to it. Uh, uh, take the alternator, get back up to it. Put the bolt onto it. Then you want to put this on. While you're holding it, put the bolt, the small, um, put the, yeah, put the bigger bolt on first, so then it'd probably be easier, so then you can line this up. And if you can still see your old spot, try to get it there too, or, you know, um, do whatever, but I'm gonna have to get the belts out off so that I got new belts for it. Put the belts over it so it's easier, and then, uh, get your alternator, hook it up, and go from there and adjust it so I'll be back with you guys once I get once I get the belts on and it connected and I get the bolts on and I'm t I'll go I'll get back with you guys when I'm tightening the bolts down okay after let's see how long do you think that took 20 minutes Cleaning the bolts. cleaning, putting the bolts on, getting the alternator on as to right now. Uh, probably fifteen minutes. Probably as of like after fifteen minutes after all doing that. All I have left is to get this one bolt on and tighten it. Of course I have to get it lined up. Adjust it and tighten it. Adjust it and tighten it. The pivot bolt? What do you mean? You don't have this tightened. Okay, so I have to tighten that. Tighten the bottom one first. Hope, I wonder if this one works. Now, uh, where's that socket? It's a lot harder to do when you're holding the camera. Mm-hmm. That's why I need a tripod. Oh, well, that's another day thing. Why isn't it turning? Oh, there we go. It go, it stops, and then it goes. Oh, wait a minute. It wasn't grabbing on. That's why. Oh. You have to make 
pretty sure it's going into that block piece back there. It feels like it. Why isn't it? Okay, hold on. Okay, had to take the belt back off. And now... Okay, see if it looks... Now you put the belt back on. Oh shoot, it came off the bottom. Get it on the bottom before you put it on the alternator. The alternator is the last thing you want to put it on. In there. there we go. And now you can swing that up. Put the bowl in. Oh wait, something came off, didn't it? Uh, probably a washer. Does it matter that much? Yes, it does. Shoot. Okay, then we go. Right there, and I'll tighten it. Okay, do you have that, uh, that small belt that Daryl gave you? Yeah. Okay, now I'll tighten on this last. one. Remember, that one. Is it snug? Oh wait, it's going the wrong direction. It could be snugger. <laughs> Everyone's gonna hear that. Snugger. Snugger. <clears throat> I think that's pretty tight. I don't want to say that about your girlfriend. Snugger. <laughs> she can be a little snugger. Well, that's the way me and my homeboys talk. Okay. <laughs> There, I think. Mm. Okay, loosen this one up just a little bit. I think I'm prime right there. Make it so. Well, she has a torn ACL. Confirmed. There we go. Uh, Virginia. Is it up there? Still What's not. The say? Were you looking at the gauge? It's not. Gone. It's not going up. Be careful. That one piece is real close to that belt. That piece of hanging down, you know.